Hi there, Iman here at White Lance, taking you through your admin dashboard. And at the moment, we're going to look through your jobs pages. So here, if you go to jobs, you'll see, first of all, there's a sub section within jobs to show you the proposals and milestones also belonging to a job. But the, for the jobs tab itself shows as normal all the data in a table. And again, you can you can search here and you can navigate at the bottom right. Uh, you can also order by status. It's quite a useful thing to do. For example, I normally order by contract. These are live contracts. And then within each contract, uh, you can see some information about them. You can also see the milestones, the proposals and the transactions relating to that contract. So let me go back and find the one I was going to show you. Okay, this is a live contract. Let's have a look at the milestones. Here there's a single milestone and we can see it's worth £10 and it's been approved. So let's have a look at the transactions for this milestone. So you can see we're now in the transactions table and we've, we're searching based on the milestone identification. And here we can see for this milestone, there were three transactions. There was the transactions where the transaction called a pay-in, where the customer was charged and they paid £10.50. And let's go and have a look at that in Stripe. Okay, so let's look at test data. And we'll try again. So here's the 1050 that was charged. And then there is the payout, which is paid out to the freelancer. So, and then there is the difference between them, which is the tenant commission. So let's have a look at that one in Stripe. So let's search by test data again. So here's the 1050 that was charged to the customer. And then 880 was transferred through to the freelancer. And so the difference between the two, which should be a pound minus any admin fees. So let's have a look at this. Yep, so it was a one pound uh, commission. So I think I'm charging 10% in this platform. The original amount was 10 pounds. So 10% of that is one pound. So one pound is charged in commission. And there is a little admin fee that's also charged to the freelancer. So they get slightly less than nine pounds, they get 888. So that's how you find jobs, search through those jobs, find relevant milestones, and then from the milestones, you can find the relevant transactions. And then from the transactions, you can go and search and see that information live in Stripe. You can also see, we didn't cover this, but you can also see the proposals that have been sent forward and the status of those proposals whether they've been accepted or just sent or whether they're just um, pending, still being drafted. Okay, um, that's everything for now. So jobs, milestones, proposals, and transactions. Uh, let me, while we're covering this, let me cover invoices as well. So there's an invoice per transaction and an invoice per, uh, so yeah, an invoice for every charge that a customer uh, pays and an invoice for every commission that a freelancer is charged from the platform. So coming back to the previous example of um, the ten pounds, so the customer has an invoice for those those ten pounds from the freelancer, and then the freelancer has an invoice of one pound that the platform is is charging the freelancer. And you can review all of those invoices here in your admin dashboard as well. Okay. Um, that's all for now. Thanks.